Today at The Serious Foodie, we're gonna teach you how to make at home a crispy skin duck breast using our foolproof method. So here's what you're gonna need for the recipe. An iron skillet, if you don't have that, you can use a nice quality stainless steel pan. A chef's knife, cutting board, two to four duck breasts. We're gonna make enough in this recipe for four people. Salt and pepper, a receptacle for the duck fat, a fruit-based glaze. We're gonna to use today the Serious Foodie pomegranate orange finishing sauce. I'm going to be scoring the fat side of the duck breast in a crosshatch pattern about three quarters of an inch apart. Make sure you don't go into the meat, just right through the fat layer. Once I get this first cut, then I'm going to make a perpendicular cut to form the crosshatch pattern. Again, just keeping about three quarters of an inch in between each one of the cuts. Now, let's liberally season the duck breasts, front and back with salt and pepper. Let's do the same thing for the other three duck breasts. Now we've seasoned and cut all of the duck breasts and we're going to bring them over to the skillet. First we're going to coat the skillet with about a tablespoon of olive oil, just enough to cover the surface of the pan. I've set the temperature of the stove to medium low. Now this is very important. This is a low and slow cook method. I'm going to take each of the duck breasts and place them into the pan fatty skin side down. What we're doing here is slowly rendering off the fat from the skin, just like the way you cook bacon. Remember when you're cooking the duck, it's sort of like making bacon. So as the duck is cooking, you may need to take a little bit of the fat out, just like this, and then just let it sit. Again, we're doing this for 25 minutes. It's been 25 minutes and the duck is nice and crispy on the skin side. And you see the other side is completely raw at this point. Now we're ready to grill right before we're ready to eat. Well now it's time to finish cooking the duck. We can do it inside on the skillet but we got a grill here and that's much cooler. All we need to do is well oil the grates. We're going to take the duck skin side up, flesh side down. We're going to lay it on the grill. And this is incidentally at about medium heat. Temperatures between 375 and 400 degrees. We've put the duck on the well-oiled grill. And we're going to leave it there for exactly five minutes. When we're done, we will turn it over and then glaze the duck. Now we're gonna put on our pomegranate orange glaze from the Serious Foodie. We flip the duck over, apply the glaze. Now we're covering it for about a minute, just enough so that the glaze sets. Now it's time to take the duck off the grill. See how nicely the glaze is set. Cover the duck and let it sit for about 10 minutes. Remember with any meat, it's very important to let it rest before you cut into it. We've let the duck sit for 10 minutes and I'm going to slice it a little bit on the bias. There you have it, your perfect crispy skin duck done at home. I'm glad you can join us at The Serious Foodie today. Come see our website for more recipes, food facts, and wine info at www.theseriousfoodie.net. And please subscribe to our YouTube channel.